Hey, I'm back now with the doctors. And if you've ever had pink eye, man, oh man, you know it is annoying. A lot of people think it really affects children, but it, as we've seen watching Bob Costas during the Olympics, it can affect everyone. It got so bad in his eyes, he had to take himself off the air. So what is pink eye? How do you get it? And what type of treatment do you have besides not being on TV? Dr. Samadhi, well, I've, you know, I mean, I've had it. You wear glasses, and they say, don't touch your eye. How do you not get it, and where does it come you, from? You've got to feel bad for the guy. You oh, know, yeah. He missed, for the first time after years and years of covering the Olympics, this is a bacterial or viral infection. Mm. The viral one is adenovirus. It's going to last about two weeks. There's really wow. no good treatment, and it has to just disappear on its own. And the best thing is exactly what he's doing, just washing your eyes and cleaning it up and making sure that you know, the inflammation. Conjunctiva is really the layer covering the eye and when it gets inflamed you have a lot of blood vessels that send those soldiers to clean and that causes inflammation you get the red eye whether it's as a result of allergies in this case we think it's an infection mm -hmm. with bacterial infection you would have antibiotics you would have either strep or staph uh, infection that we can give you antibiotics but this could be exactly what you said it could be the trauma from having his lens there and got infected mm -hmm. and you're right you don't want to touch your eyes because if you get any infection there you're done one of the big thing is stop sharing towels if somebody these are very yeah. very contagious pink eye especially the viral one somebody else is using the towel and you touch it mm -hmm. right there you have it make sure you wash your hands Mark, all the time. Is, uh, pink eye conjunctivitis or all that are they the same family and uh, it's the same thing I treat okay. a lot of this in the office and the the clue here is that it's both eyes involved. Both eyes means it's either infectious or allergy, as David said. If it's very itchy, it's allergy. If it starts to weep, it's more likely infectious. If you get crust on your eyelid, it's more likely bacterial. Most of the time it's viral, spreads easy. If it's bacterial, we use eye drops. I use something called Vigamox, which is a, a, a Cipro type of eye drop. I like to use that. I want one warning for patients out there. Internists love to give antibiotic drops that have steroids in them. That's mm -hmm. really dangerous because it could be herpes too. Now it's rarely herpes of the eye, but if it is and you give steroids, it's gonna get worse. Beware, if you get antibiotic eye drops, fine, but if an internist starts giving you something super, super strong, have, have them send you to an ophthalmologist. An okay. eye doctor. Well, I guess Bob Costas has another week or so to go before he gets better and mm. hope he does. He's going to feel better in a few days. And also, good you want to watch know. out for lupus and other things, ulcerative colitis. But he'll get well. well he'll get well. Very good. Doctors, wonderful to get all this great advice.